Hello YouTube, this is Azza for the Cookie and welcome back to another Cookie Run video. So, I know it's been a while since I uploaded, I'm sorry about that. I just haven't been playing it much, but now, since we have a new update with the Wind Archer pet and the Wind Archer trial, I thought I'll do a video on a trial because I haven't done that yet. Because the Wind Archer was a buffed old cookie, I already had it pretty high level and had the Magic Candy to level 4. So right now, I'm just getting the Magic Candy to level 5. I have some magic powder saved up but anyway I'll have some more videos later like maybe um, information on my guild because my guild's pretty high level and it's uh, for level 70 plus people so if people are interested in that I'll probably do a guild video and I might do another tr tips and tricks video even though my one from a, about a year ago is still pretty good anyway what I'm doing now is I'm checking what treasures you need um, for the trial good way to look at it just look at the leaderboards and scroll down until you see the free treasures that people used now I actually got pretty lucky with my treasure draws I only spent like a few thousand crystals and got the treasures I need to level 7 but the reason why I don't level them up more is because again there is a really good event called the two times treasure event where two times more likely to get treasures and that's what I use to max out my treasures so once that event comes I'll probably make a video about it. Alright, so on to the gameplay. So actually, I decided to go for a different treasure because the leaderboards got updated the next day and I saw someone use the Malice treasure and it turns out that it does help because you can shoot at the birds while destroying obstacles so you don't have to worry about the obstacles at some points, which is very nice. And anyway, so for this trial you have to make sure that you always shoot the birds or monsters as soon as possible because you really want to get into that last transformation otherwise you'll lose out on some like 20 million points. And while the Malice treasure is active, make sure you destroy as many obstacles as possible. As you can see this is nowhere near a perfect run, I did miss a lot of jellies but e even with this setup I still managed to get top 100 to 1%. I I know it will go down in time but I'm fairly certain this will be enough to get you into top 5% so definitely top 5% with this strategy. So these three treasures, the Malice, the Archer treasure and the cards and just make sure you just keep spamming that slide button. You gotta kill those birds as soon as possible. In terms, for the map, in terms of the map it's not really that bad. Um, I only got hit like twice about that's only because I kept trying to kill the birds fast enough and also you want to make sure that while you're in the transformation you don't miss a bird because sometimes the last shot will actually miss one of the earlier birds if you haven't killed it. I do realise that if you don't have the skin the old birds but you know what I'm talking about. And also when you destroy those obstacles you can see that there's jellies that come out the flowers make sure you collect as many of those as possible as well to assure maximum points. And the most important thing is when you are in the last skill, the last ability, you do want to make sure at the end when it does the final shot you hold the slide button as a side from the jump. Because if you hold the jump button then you will do, it will count as a jump and you only get to do one jump after the transformation. But if you hold the slide button you are allowed to do two extra jumps which allows you to collect the most amount of jellies after the skill. And if you hold it you'll be right at the top of the screen. If you saw that, I also jumped as soon as I got that malice to destroy obstacles. And just before bonus time, you want to make sure you have your counter says one, so you have one left before bonus time. That's a good, it's a good indication to show that you have a good run. Uh, one time I actually was in my ability just before bonus time, and that turns out it was bad because I missed the jellies from the bird. So you want to make sure you have. One, one bird left to shoot just before bonus time, you should be fine. And then coming up into these last few stages, just want to try not to choke. I actually, I've missed, I missed one of the, the birds right at the end here and it really annoyed me, but towards the end, not that bad. Here you want to make sure you want to jump early to collect these bears. I actually missed both of them, you have to jump earlier than that. And here, try and delay the last bird to right at the end. 
that, that ensures the maximum distance during the last skill. As you can see, I got all the birds and then I held slide. One, two, bang. And that's how you do it. I hope you enjoy this video. See you guys later.